playing Thomas was alone. Right. Where's Chris gone? Was he off somewhere? Plotting Claire's downfall? Claire was honest. And she had to be because she was a superhero. This was a troubling turn of events. I like how they're Im imposing. Reasonably sized bodies of water to cross. They're just imposing. Oh shit! Imposing personalities on these people, on these uh, little shapes. So we know that this tall John, long John, is an arrogant piece of shit. He's horrible. Thomas is silly and idealistic. He's like Ned Stark from Game of Thrones. And Claire just gives herself way too much credit. Down you go, Claire. told her that there were multiple paths across with various possible configurations of the little posse. They were doing really well. Claire hoped she could get them all across. John was fully aware he could do this alone. Thomas hoped he'd never have to. Well, Thomas is- Oh, Thomas is a drown! He's drowning! Thomas! Thomas, get your shit together, Thomas! Oh my god, Thomas. <laughs> Alright, clear. Come on, Claire. Oh, Thomas was a squished. The sequel to Thomas was alone. Thomas was a squished. I just hope we never have to see Chris again. Claire was alone. Which was odd. Because... She wasn't meant to be alone. She needed to be where there were rectangles to save. Being the only superhero in a given space kind of defeats the object. Spikes? That was new. Claire avoided them. She decided they were most likely her kryptonite. Not the rubbish red kryptonite either, the proper radioactive green stuff. Proper radioactive green stuff. Right. Yeah, how many times did I die in Bioshock? Well, deja vu. The world was repeating. And this time Thomas was here. Claire felt something had gone wrong. Fucking jump buttons. A disturbance in the force. Something had altered the matrix. The world was reacting to their progress. It was amassing its forces. It was plotting against them. Oops. Claire finally had a nemesis. I need the momentum. Fucking ah! Fucking no! Okay. Oh! Yes! Oh! 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 God. You know, I like that this game requires 
not as much focus as Bioshock does. Oh, fuck! So I can actually react to it? Ugh. Our built protections into the system when overlaps occurred, the world generated a splitter to remove the unwanted additionals. It's like a what blood sound investigates it captures and it removes from play. Laura was pleased this one was behind a wall. Maybe he'd never know what she could do. Maybe, maybe they could just have a conversation. Hang out. Stop being such a creeper, Laura. He didn't find out what she could do. Which would never happen so long as they stayed separate. Laura didn't have time to worry about the ominous pixel cloud. It had been following her for some time and it had kept itself to itself until now. Oh shit, Laura! Laura is just a big tramp she a big old trampoline. As the square Shyly introduced himself as Chris, bounced atop Laura. She began to worry that he was just using her like all the others had. They'd all bounced too, and then they disappeared when her back was turned. Only the ominous pixel cloud ever remains, looking a little bigger and a little less hungry with every disappearing friend. So the pixel cloud is evil. With every bounce, Laura found herself less and less irritated by Chris. She started to miss him when he wasn't there. On oh. another platform or something. Come on, Laura. I, I can't believe I'm enjoying the narration. I thought I would hate it. She'd wonder what he was up to. Was he missing her? He wasn't saying very much. in love. She was perfect. He had to tell her so. <laughs> At some point, he would definitely tell her. Probably best to wait for a moment the large, ominous pixel cloud wasn't about, though. Yeah, probably best to wait. Get back there, Laura. Oh, I'm so done. That's the exact opposite of what I want to do. This is so interesting. I'm so awesome. Oh man. Oh, everyone's bouncing up on Laura now. Oh, I don't feel so lonely, Laura! Oh god. Christopher and Thomas and John fucking loved it. That's uh, Polygon Mating Habits as narrated by David Attenborough. I'm standing in the midst of a geometric desert where three rectangular shapes hit upon the flattest. Oh, it's party time! I'm in this shit! Oh, fucking yes! I love it! I love it! 
Alright, what do I need to do in this game? <laughs> Chris was massively disappointed to run into the gang again. He'd enjoyed the alone time with his new girlfriend. <laughs> Uh, Laura, go down, 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 down. Laura, say what? All right. Don't worry, Chris. We're just looking after your one true love. Promise nothing. Promise there ain't too much bouncing. Is a lie. Say it out loud. Uh, Didn't want to scare her off. Help! Uh. Oh, I can, I can. Hey! Christopher! Oh shit. Oh fuck. I can't, be I can't believe I've done this. Oh, oh, oh god. Did I just bone myself? Oh my god. No, Chris! Oh no! Oh! Chris, you're so fucked! Oh god, I gotta restart the level. No, he can't get out. Chris was massively disappointed to run into the gang again. He'd enjoyed the alone time with his new girlfriend. I did something that you're not supposed to do. I was a too little intro out loud, he told himself. He didn't want to scare her off. I was not holding the fucking A button. Thanks for providing the lore support, Chris. <laughs> the others seemed suspicious of Laura and the eager looking pixel cloud of death which seemed to be watching her. Sure, they'd use her inherent bounciness to reach slightly higher jump points, but they wouldn't strike up a conversation with her. Chris found them rude. Rude and always there. Oh, wait. All right, it's time to hop on the Laura train. Hit them buttons is what I'm talking about. Get in the hole. Oh, oops, that's right, you're supposed to go there. Beep, beep, beep. Blue. Oh, yeah. Anyone want to look up how many levels are in this game? The others wouldn't drop it. Who's that cloud guy? Why is he following us? What's that rumbling hungry sound he keeps making? Chris, can we just leave Laura behind? Oh, yes! Oh, Long John. Rude.
Hey guys, Laura is the worst. Alright, I think... I think it's pretty clear we're gonna need... Mr. Squarey Man. Shit, oh shit, oh shit. Alright, I think I know how I'm gonna do this. Alright, here it is. Girl. All right. Laura, I've come to bleed on you. Who Nimble John wants to know what's going on? He'd like to attend. Alright. Let's get Le Femme Bounce up this. How on earth am I going to pull this one off? Alright, um, so she can't jump onto that one. Maybe if I do it like this? She's gonna get crushed. <gasps> oh my god, it's gonna be brutal. Oh shit! <laughs> get on up there. She got flung, man. <laughs> High flying Laura. Fucking welcome to physics. Come on, take precedence. There we go. time. Woohoo! Is there room up here, Chris? Is there room up there? Is there room up there on Laura, Chris? Oh, shit ass. Okay, there we go. Laura, it's me, Christopher. I'm your bloody boyfriend. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. These ones seem to be sticking around too. Not like those losers from before.
Uh-oh. That was deeply satisfying. The pixel cloud was getting closer. It was spending more and more time hovering around. Laura could tell it was making the others uncomfortable. Ah! Get up there, Laura. I want you to go do it, Laura. Shit, Laura! Oh! Oh, shit. Jesus Christ. Fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Alright. We're going to need to work together. Fuck you, Chris. Get in your slots. No simulation can support too many entities. At a certain point, something has to give. Thomas AT23612 hadn't possessed those exact personality traits. It's likely the story would have ended there. We'd still be in business. Thomas did not like the cloud. He'd long since stopped listing his observations, but he instinctively observed that this thing was bad. You've been right about the water. Coming back for you, Chris, you bottom feeder. I rescue him, like this. Did I hurt- did I hurt some ears? Uh-oh. Oh, Claire. Ah, Claire, get off me. Jesus, Claire. Jesus, Claire. 
Oh, I see. Can we do it like this? was in love and that was fantastic and everything but that didn't mean they could let the doom cloud keep following them thomas was going to put his foot down once they got to the next level I need to do some scouting. Alright, how do we get up there? Okay, so I need to go left, left, okay, wait, right, right, jump, left, left, jump, right, right, jump. Oh god, I'm gonna do this, alright, so... Okay, look. Fuck. can do this. Oh! <laughs> I know this, I know, I know this isn't the solution. I'd be amazed if I could do that. Yeah. 
Fuck yeah, that's how we get it done. That's how we do it. Oh shit, yeah. John, get in there, underachiever. I'm gonna take a break. That's my impersonation of the music. It's gonna be a short one. Stay tuned, more stuff coming up.